talk about rape culture and it's like, oh, it's just, you know, this is what you do to get help. We talk about the victims. We don't address the issue of the perpetrators, the people who are actually going out and doing this. So I think what she's doing with these very provocative videos is showing that this is what happens. It's not so much about the victim, it's about the people, the person doing it. And you, you know, too many times, like I said before, with the victim, it's like, oh, you know, we'll help you, you know, this is, it's not your fault, it's not your fault. And she's coming out and saying, no, it's not your fault, it's his fault. Right, right. And it needs to be in your face. It needs to be graphic. It needs to be provocative. Because we, where we are in society, that's the only thing that gets our attention. You can't sugarcoat everything. Well, yeah, no. I, I think... Or, yeah, exactly, you exactly. Know, I'm going to keep referring because we had an hour discussion about this one topic on the bottom line. And one of the things that, you know, that we talked about is simply that this is nothing new. It's not, this is not a new thing. Um, you know, everybody knows I was here at Federal State almost 20 some years ago. Same situations would go on, you know, over in Vance Hall, which they don't even use that building no longer.